everyone here with a new style of video I'm going to do with the mandolin. Up here on my um, my computer there, I've got the chords blowed up for you. Let me scroll them down with some bit. We're going to do this D, C, G, and E minor, which is right here. Okay? Blow those back up so that you can see them. This is going to be what they call two and two. Two fingers, two frets, playing. Your first one is going to be right here and right here. That's your G. It's the third fret, first set of strings. Second fret, second set of strings. In order to get your C, you just move those over. So you're going to go to second fret, third set of strings, and third fret, um, second set of strings. That's your C. Your D is going to be your two outsides of your second fret. And then your E minor is going to be your two insides. You would normally do it like that, but I'm going to do it this way. Okay? So you got G, C, D, E minor. All done within two frets. Very simple, easy movements. We're doing this one, this one, this one, and this one. The reason why I'm doing those there is because I want to stay within those two frets. Now let me shut this thing off for just a second because there's no reason in that they're being on because it will mess us up. You can do thousands of songs right here. This train is bound for glory. This train. This train is bound for glory. This train. I mean, you name it. You can go on and on. Do Alan Jackson. Have you been to Jesus for the cleansing power? Oh, he was in the blood of the Lamb. Have you truly trusted in his grace this hour? Oh, he was in the blood of the Lamb. Are you both, are you both in the blood? In I mean, you can just go on and on and on and on and on. It doesn't make a difference. I goofed up a little bit there at the end. But um, something popped up on my screen over there, and I was looking in my screen, and I saw it, and I was <laughs> wasn't paying attention to it. But anyways, two and two. Y'all take it easy and have a blessed day.